while ago. Hello humans. It is the next day, clearly something happened. Well, what happened is my friend came over and we just got talking and I did the laundry. This is a continue, yeah, continue. This is not a new vlog. Yep. Anyway, hello humans, this is a con I gotta stop, jeez Heather, what are you saying? I just woke up, so excuse the repetitiveness. Maybe like a half hour ago, I watched one video on YouTube to kind of sit down and relax and drink my coffee. But yesterday I did get distracted and I just need to calm down and focus myself and finish cleaning. A couple of my nails popped off, so that's fine. I also fell down the stairs and bruised my arm. So yesterday, I was productive a little bit. Like I got laundry done, I did the cat boxes, I swept the basement, cleaned the cat water bowls, did a uh, brand video for the Yuda, Yua Pet Water Fountain. Um, I have to redo it because, I, like I mentioned, I kind of messed that one up, so I had to refilm it because I forgot to mention a couple things. But my cats still love it. It's great. But tomorrow is Shiloh's birthday and I really, really gotta start decorating because the girls will be here at noon tomorrow, one a little earlier. Um, I gotta get my house cleaned up. I mean, it's probably gonna be a mess when they leave anyway, but... I don't know, I have this thing where like, I don't like having guests over at my house to me be messy. Like, let me know if you guys can relate down in the comments because... Yeah, like I have friends who be like, girl, your house is not a mess. You're fine. But to me, I see that little speck, that little itty bitty speck and I'm just like, I didn't fuck but yeah, let's get cleaning and setting up the party. I gotta move my dining room table into my office along with some other miscellaneous things. Cat stuff tomorrow is gonna go upstairs because the girls are not gonna be, the humans are not gonna be allowed upstairs. Um, they're allowed down here and in the basement. So cats have a safe haven upstairs. I wish I had a baby gate to put there, but I don't. And ouch, I gotta figure out how to, I'm not the only person who's fallen down the stairs and we have a ghost spot, I'm getting off topic, but the floors periodically will have this really, 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 really slippery spot. No matter what I do, it doesn't go away until it like moves. I call it the ghost spot because it randomly appears at different spots on the hardwood. It drives me crazy. And clearly it gets, it causes me to fall.
gonna take a break for a minute while I show you guys some of the decorations I got for Shiloh for her birthday tomorrow. While taking these out of the box, I looked at what actually came in these things and it actually isn't a tablecloth. So I need to go out and get like a tablecloth. Just love that. Actually, I might have one already, but who knows. I got these little balloon things you use for balloon arches. It came with two of them. I like to make balloon arches like every time. I got a giant bag of balloons, just rainbow balloons because like the girls love to play with the balloons. I like to put them in the basement because my cats like to eat the latex. So I'm obviously gonna have to do another deep clean when the party is over. So just kind of love that for myself. Ooh, what's this? It does not say this is not listed. Okay, maybe it's a tablecloth. But it came with some green balloons. What are you doing? Chula. It's a box. Glass. And it came with like some pink and white balloons. Some of them have koalas on them. I'm not gonna open this now because the moment I do, I know my cats are gonna be like, hey, what you doing? It came with like these little straw things for the, um, oh, maybe that's what this is. The uh, giant two-piece koala foil balloon. I think that's what this is. Maybe it looks like it. And I'm gonna have to open it. I am. At least feel it. Are you a foil balloon? What are you? Yep, this is the giant koala balloon. Okay, so still need to get tablecloths. I love that. I'm gonna keep saying that because that's just kind of who I am. It also came with a koala banner that says happy birthday and another one that is just a bunch of koalas with hearts. So I'm gonna hang these up. Well, last year I had them in the dining room and I actually have art on the dining room wall. So I might have to take down my Christmas wreath and put that up there and then maybe find another place for the happy birthday one that's maybe above the art pieces that we did. And I'll figure it out. But it also came with some ribbon to help secure it and tie up the balloons. So that's that. Oh, I also, it said it came with a cake topper, but I have not seen that. Maybe it's in one of these bags. Maybe I got rid of it, I don't know. But I got these adorable koala, and she looks in the box, like cupcake toppers. I don't know if I'll use these because I have a pink cupcake stand that I have a feeling I tried to put cake, cupcake toppers on them last year and they didn't fit with the toppers. So maybe we could put them on after as the girls are picking them. I had to switch to my Canon because my phone so rudely didn't have enough storage space for me to keep filming. So me vacuuming was kind of cut off, which is fine because I probably wasn't gonna include the entirety of me vacuuming my diary room. I'm just disassembling my tripod and getting ready for my Canon. So and then I'm gonna continue to clean out here. I did do like around the edges and stuff because I usually take the head off the vacuum and then do like the smaller spots and then the uh, the baseboards, that's the word. I do the baseboards with it. But that's all done, I did do that. And now I'm gonna bring up that table. And still waiting, I did put an order in to get a tablecloth. I know, really weird, right? Uh, I got some other things too, but when it gets here, I'll show you guys.
you do. I don't like doing things while you're in the room with me, true love. It's like gonna hurt you. five of them for $51 so it was like a steal and yeah While I was in the basement rummaging to see if I had a tablecloth already because I'm being patient the instacart guy came Yeah Like that was so fast and you guys can't even see me again So I'm gonna show you guys what I got on instacart man. I love you Canon, but geez the Cats are downstairs scratching. Sorry. I'm just moving my tripod around But here's the bag I got this cute pink bowl With paper in it or water. <laughs> you guys would have to watch Apollo to know what I'm talking about. If you know who Apollo is, leave a bird emoji. I kind of just gave it away, didn't I? Oh, these are so small. Damn, bye. Mm. Bye. Got those. Those are sparkling grape juice and apple juice, in case you guys couldn't see it from the maybe three feet away you are. Pink tablecloths. Got two of them because this is a long boy. Serving utensils. I'm not entirely sure what these scoopers are for, but I'm assuming they could be used for like chips or ice. Um, and this might be a bit extra. But I got some doilies. Because I like like the old school look of like pretty tablecloths and fanciness. And I'm just gonna put this bag here for my cats because they love bags. Those love cats, love bags. 
You want no paper? Paper? She's looking at me, but I don't know. So. You could tell over here has become the dumping ground for things. I'm just gonna do one side at a time. Okay, one side at a time. Everything go over here for now. change, but change is inevitable as you look. This, I got this from Target a while ago, but I got this at the thrift store. It's a cupcake holder. This holds like 24 cupcakes and I love this thing. It's so cute. It has like a heart on the top. This one actually does too. I'm assuming this is from Target too. I'm not entirely sure, but this look. I mean, this one's a little small for this, but you know, it's okay. It's okay. Hey guys, so it's like day three of planning this party. So far, you guys saw me set up the living room and stuff, and now that it's today is the day of the party, I'm working on the balloons, and the girls will be here in about two hours. So hopefully, I can get this all done in two hours, building a balloon arch. Yay! <laughs>
much. It's a little wobbly, but I mean, they're balloons. Um, it is what it is. Maybe I should tape it against the wall, but I don't know. How does it look? I think it looks pretty good. And then here's the rest of the dining room so far. 